so hi ran vijay hi brother so i wanted to ask you you missed out last season so did you have any complaints about the last season so no sul hosting it actually uh, after 2020 for four years i think i was in new york things and i missed two seasons not just one and uh, you know this one of those things that when you are with your relatives or in a relationship and somebody goes to canada or the uk or the us and uh, then you remember a lot of those small small things that you love or then the heart grows fonder so i think in the last four years and tv and i have actually missed each other so much and now that we've come back in a in a season that's 20 which is a milestone season it's uh, fantastic of course we missed each other i missed them tv but uh, while those four years were happening uh, i was doing different things and tv was trying to figure out uh, a way of you know uh, and doing the show in a different way and uh, but there was no like there was no that we are not going to work or i'm not going to work it was just it so happened that we were in that situation but always knowing that we will come back and no better season than season 20 because it's a double floss you know the legacy of 20 years and uh, i think i think the break made us uh, this 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 will come back even more special this season was special it's almost like it was written in a script that the do sarile we want to have run here to come back and then it become big so i i think i think it works how do you find sonu sud hosting the show i love sonu yeah i have a, a lot of respect for uh, sonu sud not just because of what he did over before that also sonu sud sir have worked together with a lot of events we've done uh, work together and then during covid it just like that is a nature that he already had he already people who knew him he already had that nature and just came out and for him to be hosting rodies was awesome because that's the kind of guy that they look after and the season that he did were like that karam on khan where you know is good versus evil and he he's the good so uh, i think i think he was the perfect choice if i was not yeah so earlier talking you mentioned biryani what is your favorite spot having biryani in hyderabad see a lot of times when you come to hyderabad there are some spots that people will say this is the spot to go it's been there for 100 yeah. years and you go to those spots yeah. because but i've done that because i've been working there for 20 years so i've done it in the first few years of mtv i would come i would go to those places but now what's happened is i have a lot of friends there like i would call basir and i'll tell basir get me the hat then we get from an authentic place not a tourist place right yeah. then i would tell us some a samyukta or i would tell my friends nagesh sir uh, nagesh sir i'm coming over nagesh kukur is from here elian nagesh is from here i've worked with them the very close family friends so now because it's been so long i won't go to a place but i'll go to my people local people and they'll get the right uh, kind of uh, biryani or hyderabadi food because andhra food also but and it's just not just biryani this what i also wanted because i've come here so often even the the local the spices the, the chicken dishes they're they're pretty amazing yeah even dosas with like all the other you know ingredients is pretty cool yeah so what is special about this season how will it be special different from is, uh, see this uh, rodi's double cross it's the theme only which and this thing uh, is all over to be looked up which means you can't trust anybody if you want to win you got to trust yourself because anybody could give you up or stab you the back for them to win so survival of the fittest and uh, i think it's all for, it's everything is fair in love and war like they say so it's very because the 20th season it, it could be the end of movies as we know it in the sense that maybe something different happens here. but if if this was a season that somebody had to win it would take everything win, for the gang leaders for the rodi so it's special because one we're also the wishes have come back two we've added some elements which will keep you guessing for the elvish has never been part of rodi's uh, neha and priya have never been together on rodi's right so a lot of these different combinations combinations in the gang leaders these gang leaders this set of gang leaders, never done anything together so that is different the journey is going to be crazy different and uh, i think we're in for a big big year yeah last question how it's rodi's is all about pushing your limits so how do you maintain your energy throughout i mean um, i think i think going having experiences and exposure kind of excites me so i am i had i in this when i was young a uh, different things were uh, were driving me now uh, i want to do good work on making an impact i have kids i want to be straight and i have high energy generally so i don't have to maintain it's just that things excite me like now this time this whole show me coming back see if it was 
that's the other thing. The first question that you asked, if it was something that kept doing, maybe it would be as exciting. But today it's exciting because I'm coming back. The reaction is crazy. They have missed me. You know, the, the, the feeling that people who watch Rudy's and continuously every day commented everywhere, where is running, they come back, come back. Gives you so much uh, validation, gives you so much uh, confidence. So now uh, these things excite me. I love um, the fact that we have the opportunity, the resources to work, to work in a field where your work is fun. I get to ride bikes, I get to do a lot of adventures. I'm very thankful and grateful. I think that keeps you charged. It's going to mother up actually. Um, and I don't take it for granted. I'm very grateful for the kind of you know work I do. And uh, we also get love for it. So, I mean, energy is always going to be like. Yeah.